Well, Michelle, administrators from the high school are apologizing tonight for the way they handled the investigation in the first video. That investigation has since expanded, as you said, because three new videos have come to light. And because of all the publicity around the high school and these new videos, students not even involved in the incidents are receiving death threats. Disturbing videos of teen extremism at a local high school sending shockwaves throughout an Orange County community. These videos of students doing Nazi salutes, chanting Nazi slogans and wearing a Confederate flag now part of a developing investigation. We've recently received new allegations, new photos and video even within the past hour and new claims that have led us to reopen and widen the scope of the investigation. The new videos became public because of this eight second video that went viral on Monday. Water polo team members were recorded at an offsite awards ceremony doing a Nazi salute while singing an obscure Nazi song. While the students were disciplined, teachers and parents were not informed of the incident. We were completely blindsided and we feel outraged. You had an obligation to let us know about this terrible event. You failed miserably. The school principal, Steve Osborne, apologized at a school board meeting. We are sorry that our investigation and our transparency with the Pacifica community fell drastically short. And now that more evidence is coming to light, Osborne says there will be more transparency with their investigation. Teachers are demanding they be part of changing the current school culture. We have to acknowledge that this is something that's in our community that, that we need to address. And as teachers, we hope to address it with the curriculum. And Mark and Michelle, as part of the investigation, the administrators say they're going to create new protocols for when these types of incidents occur. As far as the death threats made against students, police are investigating those death threats. They say student safety is of the utmost concern. Those kids head back to school next Wednesday. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.